Hello everyone, welcome to the Jcast Network. I'm your host, Aaron Herman. Hanukkah is upon us, and it's time to light the menorah. Let's light for the first night. Baruch Atah Adonai Eloheinu Melech Olam Asher Kiddush Anu Totav V'tzivanu L'hadikner Shel Chanukah Baruch Atah Adonai Eloheinu Melech Olam Shasani Sim Lavoteinu Bayamim Ahem Bazman Hazeh Baruch Adonai Eloheinu Melech Olam Shechianu Vikimanu Vigyanu Lazman Hazeh Chanukah is a time to celebrate and give back. We had the opportunity to attend the Birth of Israel Alumni Community J-Care event. We brought packages to Russian Jews on the Lower East Side. Let's take a closer look and learn more about what people think about Hanukkah. Um, okay, I decided to get involved today because my friends had done some of these events before and um, I just, it's a really fun opportunity in New York to do something to make other people feel good and it makes you feel good and I thought it would be a really fun way to meet people and do something nice on a cold day and um, Hanukkah means to me, I don't know, for me it's all about like tradition and celebrated it since I was little and was always with lots of family and it's just like a really um, good feeling and a sense of belonging and it's nice to celebrate it with all these people. I decided to get involved with this program because I've done it twice before and it's always been a great experience helping out with those less fortunate and meeting lots of other great young people who live in the city and work around the city and it's a lot of fun. And Hanukkah, for me, is a great time to spend with friends and family. So this is an exciting day, and you have uh, a number of young professionals that have come out to help the Russian Jewish community. Tell us a little bit about the project. Well, we've joined up with this wonderful organization to help Project Ezra with their homebound Russian elderly, who are many very isolated, very financially strapped and really can't afford holiday food or even just week-to-week -week food and they graciously donated and packaging this food and going to deliver it to them and and really just help them out this holiday time and and keep them a little give them a little company a little a little smile you know in such a tough time and you know during these difficult times uh, visitors are, are critical for the elderly they, they want to have that connection especially during the holidays where it's a very lonely time so lonely. and um, Whenever they had that that young blood coming into their, yeah. their it, it becomes some, something more. Um, did you give any advice to them when uh, when they do meet these people who have maybe a language barrier? Yeah, we just want them to come and bring their smile. You know, a smile is universal, and that energy that I mean, just the energy in this room is just so magnetic and. And to have that opportunity for them to share that with, with elders who don't really get that ever. You know, they, some of them don't even get a chance to leave their house. And, you know, just, just give them some of that and, and it'll make such a huge difference. We have, th these people have been waiting weeks for this day, have called us and counted down for this moment. So it's, it's, it's a huge, huge day and we're so appreciative that we have this kind of support. I uh, just got involved. I went on the reloaded trip last summer, you know, met a lot of great people and uh, thought this would be a nice thing to do, start out the weekend and uh, you know, be in the Hanukkah season and everything, so, uh, so far it's going great. And are you looking forward to something, like, as you deliver these, uh, these, these boxes? I am very anxious to see, you know, people be, you know, happy to receive the gift and uh, just kind of see some young, energetic faces, I'm sure we'll kind of cheer them up. J-Care is there for the community to go beyond their daily routine and make a difference. Tell us a little bit about the program. 
J-Care to Us is a program that gets people in our community involved with the larger New York City community. And as you can see today, getting all these young people up early in the morning to come serve the community is really a big thing for us. We do projects three to four times a year like this where we have people coming to deliver food um, in the Lower East Side with Project Ezra. And then we do other campaigns throughout the year like blood uh, donations or bone marrow drives and things like that. And you know, whenever you see people getting involved, it's like they get that warm and fuzzy feeling because like you can see like they're really invested in helping people. Uh, what has been some of your own inspiration when you, when you saw them getting involved? Well, I think ever since I started this job, when I was told that I'd be arming this um, department for us, I was just super excited. I mean, just seeing all the energy in the room. I mean, some of these people come and do this every time. Some of these people are here for the first time. And just watching the energy and actually going on an actual delivery is really an honor. And just to see that connection between a young person and someone that just probably doesn't have that much company and they get to see this bright young face, it's really nice. And Kanaka is upon us. And like, what, what's your, what, how, do you, how do you explain what Kanaka is? For me, Hanukkah is about you know family being together. Um, you know the light. You know if we can say that of just doing good. So that's why we wanted to do this during Hanukkah so that we could warm up people's homes. Okay, I decided to get involved because I thought it would be fun to volunteer, just to try to give back. I know a lot of people they don't have a lot, so I thought it would be helpful, um, especially right before Hanukkah, the holidays. When some people, they're so isolated, it would be good to come and bring food to people. Um, but I just decided to get involved today because I was, you know, I, I used to volunteer a lot in, in college and I haven't in a, in a while. Um, and then that email came into my inbox and I was like, oh, this is perfect. So I, I signed up for it. Um, Hanukkah, to me, second question. Uh, it's just, I don't know, it's a time to be with my family and, you know, it's the holiday season. So it's time, time for giving, I guess. The participants of this J-Care project were extremely excited from the moment that they packed those boxes to when they entered the doors of the apartments. Um, during Hanukkah, it's important to give back to the community at large. And for many of these Russian Jews, this is the first time that they're actually connecting to uh, young Jewish professionals. <laughs> As you can see, it was an extremely successful event where young professionals are truly making a difference in the lives of Russian Jews in New York City. This is Aaron Herman. Thank you for watching.